Access granted. Hey there YouTube, today we are going to have a look at scatter damage meters and this is a DPS and information uh, tracker like um, recount. It, it just do a shit more tracking if you ask me and it's I really like this one. I actually like it better than um, recount but so far I have a DPS up. This is from my last uh, fight so if you click this little cross here. I want to reset scatter, so we just reset it. But basically, here you have the um, option. So this is the win win uh, window or the yeah, window here called scatter. And this is all the things that you can mode. You can set it to like buff up town, CC breaks, DPS damage, damage taken, damage taken by spells, death, the debuff up time, dispels, enemy stuff, energy gained, and healing, holy power, interrupts. That would be a good one in raids. Overhealing, good for healers of course, uh, rage gains, wounded power gains, threat. Yeah, so you don't need like this and let's say omen as a threat meter. You can have this window up and make a new window and you can then have a threat meter also. A total healing and you can segment like this fight you're in, like every time you go to a new mob or the total engagement and of course you can hide and lock the window. You can also go down here and, and configure it in here in, uh, in interfaces and uh, scatter. So if you can see here, we have windows, so th it's these little f things here, and uh, this one's called scatter, That's it's the one that we are currently using here, so we can also lock it so we can move it around. So let's just unlock that. So if uh, you want to make a new one, let's say we want to make a thread, so we would just call this um, pip, and you just press OK, and of course we want that as a bar, you can also set it as data text or inline bar display. But let's just keep it as a bar and uh, then you can set up the uh, pip down here to so delete it if you don't want it anymore bars like the uh, some customization of the class colors click through uh, how you want the bars to look let's take that one title bar how you want that one to look window how you want that one to look and mode switch uh, wipe mode if you want to switch those to something else uh, combat mode when you go into combat you want to change it so there's a lot of customization here data resets when you want it to reset uh, rejoining a group uh, going into an instance so if you go into a dungeon it will ask you can either say yes just automatically reset everything or it will ask you and the same here with leaving a group uh, tool tips yeah, that explains the general options. You can see a show totals, height when solo, height in combat. Uh, you guys can see here, there's a lot of stuff you can um, customize. Always social, social fighting, PvP, only keep uh, boss fights, data feeds, damage personal, damage rate, threat personal, damage number. Yeah, and this is like the number format. We have columns. You can see all here. There's a lot of stuff you guys can go into. Disable models. Uh, click at the models that you want to disable if you don't want any of these to be tracked. CCs, go cooldowns. You can also do that. Themes, if you want to theme it. And of course, thread, uh, shake screen, play sound. So let's play a sound e explosion. Show raw threats. Uh, use focus targets. So yeah, it's it's really really customizable. Um, but let's um, go in and attack this little dummy over here. So we see right now here we have the threat and we have the uh, DPS. So it, it's really uh, neat, and you can then click on. Let's say we click on this one. It go into detail to see where the threat is coming from. The same here with the DPS. You can see like what attacks. Uh, are, are, are doing the most damage basically so it's it's really a, a neat system like i said it's it's really easy to use and then if you right click on it here you go one step back so you go right click on it again so let's see we want you can see how many death there's been uh, taken damage taken by spell damage taken damage done so instead of dps it shows total damage and how many percent each party members have done it so yeah, it's it's really neat. And like I said, you can make shit out of windows up here. You can also just go back here and we can say we want this one to be DPS meter. So this is like the total DPS. So if you were in a group, 
like all the other party members will be down there. Or if you just want to own track, uh, track your own, you can just go in here and see what, again, abilities are doing the most. Uh, Rampage just went up. Uh, I do Plot Thirst is one of the biggest ones. This one must be uh, Auto Attack, I guess. Or just attacks in general. Whirlwind, Whirlwind, off hands. So you can, like, like I said, I really find this uh, um, usable. Let's try and do that one. So yeah, it's really a, a neat one. And like I said, there's a shitload of stuff you can go into. You can also customize it on the fly. So let's go back to DPS here. Let's go into details. And then here, that's uh, scared is this one and pip is this one. So let's go down here. And then you can just on the fly, you can say like we want buff up time. Oh, sorry. Peep ups here. So it will go into that and then again you can click on it and show what kind of buffs you have up. So it, it's really really neat. So anyway, I hope this gave you guys a little like um, insight into what scatter damage meter was. Or is. It, it's one of the mo like, most popular used uh, damage meters and healing meters. Uh, Track, I think you will call it, uh, outside the uh, scat, and I see a lot of people um, moving over to this one because, like I said, it it's just a little bit easier to use, and like I said, you can just click you through most of the stuff that you want. So, and, and it's like really, really neat. So if you go down here, we can see this is the total amount so of of options you have. So it's it's really, really fucking awesome. Like I said, it tracks interrupts and all that, and it's really, really neat. So, like I said, I hope this helped you out, and. Uh, I won't like like with most things. I, I won't spend like hours going totally into to uh, uh, death with it and show every options, but just like glance over and show you like a couple of things, and then and you guys get an idea of what it is. So um, yeah, I will see you guys later, and um, hope you have an awesome day, and bye bye.